Hello everybody, welcome back to No Review Playthrough with Ryan today. Today we're back playing the epic card game, mission number four, the giant raid. So let's see what we've got. So, for some reason giants have begun destroying the village. Defeat them before they make you their next meal. Great. Alright, so let's see what we've got. So we're going to have to be fighting a lot of big creatures around. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Okay. I got a little bit of everything. I don't like losing life just to draw new cards. I can draw quite a few cards if I need to. So let's go ahead and do this. Well, we probably should just go ahead and start with the mythic monster right off the bat and get a card draw. All right, I have no free cards, so we'll pass it to them. So, yep, they got a lurking giant. <clears throat> so I imagine it's going to be hard to get through this. Okay, so their turn. And wild Worm Champion. Great. Alright, we got 14 to 14. I can block without killing. Yeah, neither of us will die. Let's see. Each player chooses a champion they control, break all others, so that means I'd lose. Well, they'd lose one of theirs. No, that's not going to help. If it's your turn, break all champions. I don't really want to do that yet, to be honest. Um, that's a slightly bigger one, so let's try it. Let's break that champion, even though it gives them a token. Because I think I can ha I can take out the other one if I need to. Okay, so that obviously removed the damage that they were going to deal. Alright, I have nothing else I can play, so we'll get my turn. Okay, so the problem is, is I need my big ones to go through. Alright, what did we draw? Okay, an ambush. Well, I can return that to their hand. But they're just going to block with the zombie, I guarantee you. That's what they would do after I do that. And I don't want to break all champions. Yeah, I don't want to do that. All right, let's just see what happens here first. Let's go ahead and do an attack before I play a card. Okay. Yeah. That's what I thought. Okay. But at least it gets rid of that. Um, still my turn. Those are ambushed, so I'd rather save them for the opposite turn. <clears throat> let's draw two cards. I might need to, I might regret, I might need to save every. Okay, so I can pump up somebody, but that's not going to help me. They'll just eat that up anyways. Okay. <clears throat> All right, well. I think I'm going to have a hard time getting through some of these guys. That's going to be a big problem here. All right, it still wants me to play the pump-up card. No. Oh, I thought they were going to get rid of my champion. Okay. So the one thing about this game is it only takes one coin to play pretty much every card or free. So they can get easy big champions out again. I'm just going to take the two... I'll just take that two from the zombie. Yeah, there's another one. Do these have haste on them? Or whatever, blitz? Yeah, they have blitz. Dunno, that's going to be hard. Dang it. Okay, well. So what I can do. Let's do that. Return that to their hand. Okay. So now, the nice thing is, I've got a head start. That zombie's going to stay. They could play something. Let's push the attack first. Mm, I don't want to do anything. Okay, I need big guys to go through, I think. So let's attack with that. Okay, just gonna Okay, well got rid of that one. Okay. Alright, so 
still my turn. So you know what, I think what I need to do is play this then. Give it even more attack. They've played their coin. They can still play freebies, but usually the freebies, of course, are not as good. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. So that'll take them down to 20 in one hit if I can get this through. There we go. Nice. Okay, that's going to put me in a big lead. I need to take every advantage. There's Kong. So what I can do with Kong is when I play him, I can deal 14 or 13 to a champion, so I might be able to kill a big giant if it comes out. Is there anything else I want to do? I'm going to save that if I absolutely have to. Those are Ambush. Let's go ahead and play this guy out then. Let's see if I can get ahead of characters out to get some guardians out. And there's my giant. We might as well, yeah, let's go. If I can get them out, get the summoning sickness out of the way. Which, oh, there's this, there's disease. That has ambush, so I'm going to wait. Well, you know what? Let's get it out. The more I can get out now, let's get rid of that zombie. Maybe I should have done a direct damage. All right, so I've got a pretty good lead now. There's a Kong there. So it's probably going to hit my... Okay, strange. Didn't hit my big guy. Okay, so we're going to start my turn. I'm going to play this on their turn. So if I can just kind of overload... Okay, so now what I can do, let's push out. So unfortunately, my Kong can't kill their Kong. Oh, no, it's a target champion, not a player. Okay, I was going to say, I could just win the game there. What did I get? To target champion, gain three health. Okay, well, that won't kill anything. All right, so I think what I'm going to do is let's see if I can bait them. Let's see if I, let's throw this out. Because if he does block with the giant, I can kill it. I'll lose mine, but get way ahead here. Okay, that's interesting. Because now they can't block with that. Okay. So that one's done for blocking. That's kind of, either way, that was a good. So let's try, maybe we'll do giant on giant action here. I'm just kind of baiting them to use all their blockers, because otherwise they're going to die. They have to. All right, so we'll both die, which is fine. Okay, now they still have a coin. Um, that's six damage, I was going to say. Let's, uh, if I send all three of those. Um, I still have my Kong I can play. So let's, let's do this. Because this could be the end. If they have nothing, no champion to play. Draw two cards. Okay, that didn't, well, I guess it could help. But they have to be freebies. So this might be the short. I might have just gotten really lucky. Gotten through that. Um, I don't really need to do that right now. So let's... Yep, there we go. Okay, well, that was nothing. <clears throat> I think I just got really lucky on that one, one draw there. All right. So let's see what we've got. So I got my own Frost Giant. All right, we might as well go ahead and go to the next one since I was short and quick. So now we've got a dragon attack. So we've got bear trees, burnt plants, and large bones scatter the ground as scaly creature emerges, and then more follow. So we can guess what's going to happen here in their deck. All right, so dragon attack. Let's see what we got. We've got a couple champions, a couple draws, so we're good. All right, so what have we got? Let's take a look at our cards. we got our giant for free. Okay, tribute, show the blues, forced exile, banish target champion, so we definitely want to hold on to that if we need to because I know there's some pretty big dragon cards in this that can be played. Break all champions for apocalypse again, so... Um, I can get two guys out. So the blue tribute won't do any good. I can draw it. Draw, get a card draw. So let's try, let's try that first. Okay. 
Got that, and then I can play the free giant. All right. I think a lot of these it just has to do with getting the momentum, getting start out first. The problem is, is there? Yeah, I didn't. I just realized. Excuse me. Almost all of these are going to be airborns. So I'm going to have to like force these guys to block. Okay, 8 damage. It's not going to kill. If I do that, they get free tokens, which they could use for blocking. Eh, I really don't want a player to call champions. That's not going to help. Um, so if I do this, it won't kill the dragon, but it has one left. But I think it's going to reset um, when my turn starts anyway. So I think that's... I was going to say, if I could get it down to one, maybe they won't block with it because they don't want it to die. Oh, do eight damage to a target. So I could just do it straight to the person during the, to the dragon attack. Let's hold off that. could be just a finishing move. Um, so let's... Yeah, let's go ahead and start my turn then because I... Yeah, okay. Because it was to a target. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Let's get some extra card draws and some champions. So a 9 to 9, 9 to 7. So either way, I lose people. But I think I might have to try and do that to see because, yeah, they're just going to fly over me. So let's go ahead and do this one. Let's go send out my giant for an attack. See if they block there. Return a target attacking champion, yeah. Okay. Interesting. Okay. So let's just replay it. Okay, let's try again, even though it's... They both had the same attack, I guess, so... They've still got their coin. Yeah, okay. It's acceptable losses, I think. All right. At least it's not going to be an attack on their side from there, so I might just have to keep doing that so that I keep the pressure up. I was going to say, what are they doing there? Going to nothing to return. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, so all right, we're going to go through. Yeah, the problem is, how do I get past all this airborne? I just have to kind of force them to block, so I draw them. Um, break target champion. Okay, I'll wait. If I do that on my turn, then I get the zombie token. Okay, let's still do the damage for flame strike. Um, forced exile. Okay. Most of these are events I don't really want to play yet. Okay. So we'll go ahead and do this. We're going to do this. Break a champion. Boom. <clears throat> Excuse me. I didn't want to do that right in the mic. I'm sorry. Okay. So, I th what do I got here? Okay. We got the same one. So, we're going we're gonna to boost, boost the damage here. Uh, you know what? Let's wait. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, I wanted to undo that. Let's see. Because I don't want to boost it and then they just block. Okay, so let's see what happens. To each champion and player. Yeah, I've just lost. Lost all those guys. Okay, so they don't have any coins, so I think I think we're good now. Let's do that. Okay, so that's going to be a, yeah, a massive hit. Okay. So now, dang it, I'm one off. One off from using this light and flame strike. So if, some, if I have some way to do damage directly to the player, then we've automatically won that one too. All right, so... Still banish champion, so I've still got my giant out. Is this apocalypse? That doesn't hurt damage champ. Okay, let's just go ahead and do this. We'll select the dragon attack. 
watch is going to take me a whole long time to get that and that's another apocalypse and it's my turn so I have my new frost giant do I have any way mm, other good champions are plus three I got another trash golem or garbage golem Could draw a card probably all right well let's just see let's just see if I can end the game here Okay, they could put a champion into play. Yeah, okay. So that's going to block. Okay, so don't want to break all champions. They could put two human tokens into play. They're just going to block. But they're going to kill mine, so let's... Uh, Okay, I don't maybe that's not good. But at least my oh no. Oh. It's cuz it was un <sighs> unbanishable. Dang it. Should have read closer. Oh, okay. I was going to say that was good good try. Okay, and then they just do it to me. Now the nice thing is at least it's I lose two of my guys. I only need one to get through, so I really don't want to do that. Let's let's do it for a draw too, because I've got another one. Okay, I think. Oh, rain of fire. There we go. I can win the game there. I can do damage directly. Okay, so it doesn't matter. Okay, we can just. I guess I could block. Oh well. Yeah, they would have destroyed him anyways. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, they just suicided it. Yeah, they did They did five to everything. <laughs> oh, okay. Maybe that's what I get for playing on normal difficulty instead of the hard difficulty. They just... Okay. I'll take it. All right, so... Yeah, it's just kind of interesting what you have to do. Uh, each one of these is slightly different. Um, the one I did, the one I did on the last playthrough, seemed almost impossible because um, they just kept swarming me. So I just, I just kind of had to use cards to deflect the damage as long as possible, and then I was just doing cards that dealt direct damage. The giant one, I think I just got lucky. I was able to get a big card for me, bump them up even more. And then I just had that that big swing, and then this one I just had to think a little bit. How do I get around the dragon airborne attacks? Because pretty much everything was going to be airborne for that. So I like where these games kind of give you a specific challenge to kind of do, and you have to think about how you play a little bit differently than you normally would. Instead of just trying to you know put out a bunch of creatures, I had to really think a little bit more about. Okay, well I know they're all going to be airborne, so I need to make sure I can. Either, obviously, I, you know, maybe myself get some airborne and had to maybe block with those. I didn't have any, so I had to kind of keep my cards that were going to banish and be careful when I banished at the right time. So hopefully I could just get a free swing um, and go from there. So, all right, there's the next two missions from Epic the Card Game. Appreciate you guys participating, watching the video today. Anytime you want to leave a thumbs up helps out the video, and I appreciate that. And I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.